Welcome, seekers of wisdom, to the Masonic Audiobook Library. Today, we embark on a journey into the esoteric heart of Freemasonry, delving into 15 timeless lessons that extend far beyond the realm of mere personal finance. As we explore these profound insights, remember that Freemasonry isn't just an ancient fraternity. It's a path to enlightenment, a journey of self-discovery, and a repository of ageless wisdom. Our guide on this mystic voyage will be none other than Manly P. Hall, a sage whose profound insights into Freemasonry have illuminated the minds of countless seekers. So let's start uncovering these secrets woven into the very fabric of Masonic teachings. 1. Frugality and Financial Wisdom In the pursuit of esoteric knowledge, Freemasons place great emphasis on financial wisdom and frugality. Manly P. Hall, in his profound works, often spoke of the importance of sound financial management. He believed that excessive debt could enslave the soul and divert one from the true path of self-improvement. Hall emphasized that financial independence allowed individuals the freedom to focus on their spiritual and intellectual growth. Albert Pike, another renowned Masonic scholar, echoed these sentiments. He saw the accumulation of wealth as a tool for philanthropy and a means to support one's Masonic endeavors. Pike believed that by wisely managing one's finances, Masons could contribute to the betterment of society, aligning with the core principles of Freemasonry. Frugality is not about living a life of depredation, but rather making deliberate choices about where one's resources are allocated. By cultivating financial wisdom, Freemasons ensure they have the means to support their journey of enlightenment, which includes their Masonic activities and charitable endeavors. In this way, financial responsibility becomes a key tenet in the pursuit of Masonic wisdom. 2. Simplicity in Appearance Freemasons have long embraced the principle of simplicity in appearance, and this idea is deeply rooted in their teachings. Manly P. Hall often discussed the symbolism of simplicity within Freemasonry. He saw it as a reflection of the Mason's inner journey, where external appearances held no significance compared to one's inner qualities and character. Albert Pike further expounded on this idea, stating that simplicity of dress and demeanor reflected a Mason's dedication to inner growth. In a world filled with materialism, Pike believed that Masons should set an example by valuing virtue over vanity. Simplicity in appearance serves as a reminder that external adornments are transient, while the virtues of the heart and mind endure. Freemasons, through their modest attire and demeanor, convey their commitment to a deeper inner journey of self-discovery and moral development. In this way, simplicity becomes a powerful symbol within Freemasonry, reminding members of their true purpose. First, as we draw back the curtain on our first point, remember that in Freemasonry, symbols hold immense power. They are the keys to understanding deeper truths. So let's begin our journey with an emblem that represents balance, knowledge, and unity. Three. Mindful Consumption Within the Masonic teachings, mindful consumption is a concept deeply rooted in the pursuit of self-improvement. Manly P. Hall often discussed the importance of mindfulness in all aspects of life, including consumption. He believed that each choice we make, including what we consume, shapes our character and influences our spiritual journey. Albert Pike, in his writings, emphasized the idea that every action, no matter how seemingly insignificant, carries consequences. Freemasons are encouraged to reflect on their choices, including what they consume, as it impacts their physical and spiritual well-being. Mindful consumption is a practice that extends beyond material goods. It encompasses the quality of one's thoughts, the content of one's reading, and the company one keeps. By being mindful of what they consume, Freemasons align their actions with their pursuit of enlightenment, ensuring that their choices support their spiritual growth and moral development. 4. Respect for Resources Respect for resources is a fundamental principle within Freemasonry, closely tied to the idea of stewardship. Manly P. Hall often discussed the concept of stewardship in his teachings, highlighting the responsibility that Freemasons bear towards the resources and gifts they've been entrusted with. Albert Pike, in his works, expounded on the notion that everything in the universe is interconnected. Freemasons are taught to view themselves as stewards of the earth and its resources, understanding that wastefulness goes against the core values of masonry. Respect for resources extends to all aspects of life, from the food we consume to the materials we use. Freemasons are encouraged to minimize waste and use resources wisely. By doing so, they demonstrate their commitment to responsible stewardship and contribute to the greater good of humanity. In this way, respect for resources becomes an integral part of the Masonic journey. Five. Preservation of Health 
In Freemasonry, the preservation of health is seen as a sacred duty. Manly P. Hall spoke extensively of the importance of maintaining physical well-being as a means to support one's spiritual journey. He believed that a healthy body provides a stable foundation for the pursuit of esoteric knowledge. Albert Pike echoed these sentiments, emphasizing that a sound mind resides in a sound body. Pike recognized that good health enables Masons to fulfill their Masonic obligations and engage in charitable work. The connection between physical and spiritual health is deeply ingrained in Freemasonry. Masons are encouraged to adopt healthy lifestyles, including regular exercise and proper nutrition to ensure they have the vitality and energy to engage fully in their Masonic duties and spiritual growth. 6. Mindful use of time. Time is a precious resource, and Freemasons are taught to use it wisely. Manly P. Hall often discussed the concept of time as a symbol of life's brevity. He believed that each moment should be cherished and dedicated to self-improvement and service to others. Albert Pike expanded on this idea, stressing that time should be viewed as a gift to be used purposefully. He encouraged Masons to avoid wasting time on frivolous pursuits and distractions. Freemasons are reminded that time, once spent, cannot be reclaimed. Therefore, they are encouraged to dedicate their time to pursuits that align with their Masonic values, such as self-reflection, study, and charitable work. By doing so, they honor the Masonic tradition of valuing time as a precious commodity. 7. Charity with Wisdom Charity is a cornerstone of Freemasonry, but it's not about haphazard giving. Manly P. Hall emphasized the importance of charity with wisdom. He believed that charity should be directed towards initiatives that create lasting positive impacts. Albert Pike further elucidated this principle, stating that charity should uplift and empower individuals rather than perpetuating dependence. Pike advocated for strategic giving that addresses the root causes of suffering. Freemasons engage in charitable work with the intention of making the world a better place. They carefully consider how their charitable contributions can create sustainable change and improve the lives of those in need. This approach aligns with the Masonic commitment to benevolence and wisdom and charity. 8. Preservation of Resources Preservation of resources is a concept deeply ingrained in Freemasonry. Manly P. Hall often spoke about the importance of conserving resources for future generations. He saw it as a reflection of the Masonic commitment to stewardship. Albert Pike, in his writings, echoed this sentiment, emphasizing that wastefulness goes against the principles of prudence and responsibility. Pike believed that Freemasons should be mindful of their consumption and strive to minimize waste. Freemasons view themselves as stewards of the earth and its resources. They are encouraged to adopt sustainable practices, not only in their daily lives but also in their Masonic activities. By preserving resources, they demonstrate their commitment to responsible stewardship and contribute to the legacy of future generations. 9. The Pursuit of Wisdom The pursuit of wisdom is at the core of Freemasonry. Manly P. Hall dedicated much of his work to exploring the profound teachings and symbolism embedded within Masonic rituals. He believed that Freemasonry offered a path to deeper knowledge and self-realization. Albert Pike, as a prolific Masonic author, emphasized the importance of continuous learning. He saw Masonry as a lifelong journey of seeking wisdom and understanding. Freemasons view themselves as perpetual students, always striving to expand their knowledge and insight. They engage in rigorous study, contemplation, and discussion to unlock the hidden truths within Masonic teachings. The pursuit of wisdom is not just an intellectual endeavor, but a spiritual quest to uncover the secrets of the universe. 10. Humility and Modesty Humility and modesty are virtues highly regarded in Freemasonry. Manly P. Hall often discussed the symbolism of humility as a key element in the Masonic journey. He believed that true wisdom came from recognizing one's limitations and seeking to grow beyond them. Albert Pike further emphasized the importance of modesty, stating that a humble heart is receptive to the light of knowledge. Pike saw pride and arrogance as obstacles to spiritual growth. Freemasons practice humility and modesty as a means to remain open to new insights and perspectives. They understand that the path to enlightenment requires acknowledging their own imperfections and constantly striving for improvement. In this way, humility and modesty become guiding principles in their Masonic journey. 11. Self-Reflection and Inner Alchemy Freemasonry places a significant emphasis on self-reflection and inner alchemy. Manly P. Hall delved into the idea of inner transformation as a central theme in Freemasonry. 
He believed that the rituals and symbols of the craft were designed to guide individuals on a journey of self-discovery and spiritual growth. Albert Pike expanded on this, stating that the true alchemy of Freemasonry occurs within the individual where base aspects of character are transmuted into virtues. Pike saw the Masonic path as a transformative process, where the initiate evolves into a better version of themselves. Freemasons engage in self-reflection as they progress through the degrees, seeking to refine their character and align with the noble ideals of Masonry. This inner alchemy is a profound and ongoing journey towards self-improvement. 12. Brotherhood and Unity Brotherhood and unity are fundamental principles in Freemasonry. Manly P. Hall spoke of the powerful bond that exists among Freemasons. He believed that Masonry was a global fraternity where members, regardless of background, came together as brothers. Albert Pike further emphasized the idea of unity, stating that Masonry teaches that all people are part of the same human family. He saw the Masonic Lodge as a microcosm of the world, where differences are set aside in favor of shared values. Freemasons view each other as brethren bound by common principles and values. The bond of brotherhood extends beyond the Lodge, fostering unity and cooperation among Masons in their efforts to make the world a better place. 13. The Pursuit of Truth The pursuit of truth is a central theme in Freemasonry. Manly P. Hall often explored the symbolism of light as representing knowledge and truth. He believed that Masonry's teachings encouraged individuals to seek truth in all aspects of life. Albert Pike echoed this, stating that the Masonic journey is a quest for enlightenment and understanding. He saw Masons as seekers of truth, aiming to uncover the hidden mysteries of the universe. Freemasons are encouraged to question, explore, and seek knowledge relentlessly. The pursuit of truth is not limited to intellectual endeavors but extends to moral and ethical truths. Masons aspire to live in accordance with truth, both in their private lives and in their interactions with others. 14. Service to Humanity Service to humanity is a core principle of Freemasonry. Manly P. Hall emphasized that the true Masonic spirit is one of service. He believed that Masonry existed to uplift humanity and alleviate suffering. Albert Pike further expanded on this concept, stating that Masons are called to be active contributors to the betterment of society. He saw charity and benevolence as essential expressions of Masonic principles. Freemasons engage in charitable work and service projects as a means of fulfilling their commitment to humanity. They recognize that their obligation extends beyond the Lodge, and they actively seek opportunities to make a positive impact on the world. 15. Seeking the Divine Seeking the Divine is a profound aspect of Freemasonry. Manly P. Hall explored the symbolism of the Temple in Masonic teachings, representing the inner sanctum of the soul where one communes with the Divine. Albert Pike delved into the spiritual dimension of Masonry, highlighting that the craft teaches profound spiritual truths. He saw Masons as spiritual seekers, drawn to the esoteric wisdom within the fraternity. Freemasons view the Lodge as a sacred space where they can connect with the Divine and engage in spiritual contemplation. The rituals and symbols of Masonry are imbued with profound spiritual meaning, inviting initiates to embark on a spiritual journey of self-discovery and enlightenment. In conclusion, we've explored 15 profound insights from the world of Freemasonry, drawing from the wisdom of Manly P. Hall and Albert Pike. These timeless teachings provide a roadmap for personal growth, self-discovery, and the pursuit of higher truths. Freemasonry, as illuminated by these principles, offers a path to becoming a better version of oneself, fostering unity and serving humanity. If you found this journey through Freemasonry's esoteric knowledge enlightening and inspiring, there's an invaluable resource we'd like to recommend, the Masonic Audiobook Library. It's a treasure trove of audiobooks that delve deeper into the mysteries and teachings of Freemasonry. By subscribing to the Masonic Audiobook Library, you'll have access to a wealth of knowledge that can further enrich your understanding of these profound concepts. Call to action. Here's how you can take action today. Subscribe. Click the link in the description to subscribe to the Masonic Audiobook Library and unlock a world of wisdom. Comment. Share your thoughts and insights in the comments section below. We'd love to hear how Freemasonry has impacted your life or any questions you may have. Share the link. Help spread the light of Freemasonry by sharing the Masonic Audiobook Library link with your friends, family, and fellow seekers. Like and share. If you've enjoyed this video and found it valuable, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others who may benefit from this esoteric knowledge. By taking these actions, 
you not only deepen your own understanding but also contribute to a growing community of like-minded individuals on a quest for knowledge and enlightenment. Thank you for joining us on this illuminating journey and together, let's continue seeking the profound truths that Freemasonry has to offer.